Right now, guys, get 15% off at EasyMutt.com. You can even buy Madden points that are 75% off. They're 50% off plus my codes and now they're 15. Go save your money and go have fun. Top 10 quarterbacks, guys. We are back. I just did the top 10 must-have. And up next, we have the top 10 pass rushers. So stay tuned for that. This is video two of three today. Number 10, we're going to go Stafford. I like him better than Flacco because he hits the 90 throw on the run, which is a threshold. So if, even if you have a blitz coming, you get pushed out of the pocket. Flacco is going to miss those throws. And you know what? Slinger 6 is a good release, but there's a reason he's number 10. He didn't get no crazy discounts, something like that. Let's keep it moving. I still think if you get Anthony Richardson and you don't mind not having discounts and you're on a budget, this guy here is still going to get the job done. He has the speed. He has the thresholds. And this guy here, he's just fine. He doesn't have the best release, but he didn't have the worst release. He does get separate lead, which is super important. So having separate lead with some speed for his price, he's a great value at number nine. And you know what? I don't blame you for using them. You're just at a disadvantage or is saving AP to set up rest of your team. And you're at a disadvantage when it comes to not having the best release in the red zone when you need to get the ball out quicker when things get tighter down in the red zone. Drew Brees is the new quarterback here. He's gonna be lacking athleticism. You're not gonna be able to get out of the pocket, but you say, hey, I'm just a pocket passer, then you're gonna really like this guy. He's gonna hit the thresholds here. Just remember throwing on the run here, not being a 90. He can miss a throw. So, can he make a throw? Yes. Can he miss a throw? Yes. So, Gunslinger is going to be his discount. Now, Fearless. Let's talk about Fearless here. He gets it for a discount. Why does that matter? It doesn't matter. Nobody is running under pressure online. That's in the defense ability. If you play online long enough, you already know that. And, yeah, it's not worth putting on this year. Definitely not worth it. Just go ahead and get Gunslinger and Sephi lead. How good is his release? His release is good. It's actually, I would say it's a top, what, three, four release in the game. I would say it's number four. So yeah, it's actually going to be good enough to set in the pocket, but you're just going to be missing certain things with him. Far as I wish, for example, um, you had a different type of discounts, like such as William Perry, has a better AP setup. William Perry has a better release and he's faster. Will Levis is here and he's gonna be good. I do like this card. He's gonna be more athletic. Slinger one is just fine. He's gonna hit the thresholds. And you know what? This card is fun. He gets Gunslinger for one and he gets an X Factor. Well, there you go. Uh, it's not the best X Factor, so I wouldn't break the bank for that. But I will say uh, he does get set feet lead. He's, he's athletic. He's good. Will Levis is still a capable quarterback in this game. Well, now we know the best free quarterback in the game is now Johnny Manziel. He's got the speed and the thresholds. So what's wrong with the card? Let's go through it. Now he's going to be able to get out there and just make people miss. You can spin all that cod and all that. It's going to be great. Generic one is not the best release, I'll tell you that. But is it a good release? Yes, his release is fine. It's not trash. But I'm going to tell you right now, when you get this guy, you're not going to get exactly what you want, right? Say you don't use gift wrap, and then you want a gunslinger discount, he doesn't get it, right? So not having the best AP setup, not having the best release, holds this card back, but hey, if you're on a budget and you're running a free quarterback, he's totally usable. Joe Burrow's release is way better than Johnny's. Joe Burrow release is the second best in the game traditional too. There you go. Now he's going to be super athletic, but he's going to hit all the thresholds in the pocket. He's going to get the ball out. Gunslinger is a great discount. And of course, he gets that feet lead. So yeah, if you're looking for a pocket passer with a great release, go get Joe. He's going to be just fine. Michael Vick is here, and Vick is fast, of course. Juke spinning, all that's going to feel great. Slinger 1's fine, and he does get an X Factor for Escape Artist, which is going to separate him from other cards. But just remember, it's not that great, right? It's not even the best X Factor in the game for a quarterback. It's going to be Trust. So keep that in mind that is Escape Artist what you really want? No, it's going to be Trust. It's going to be a little bit better. But I will say that, yeah, he doesn't have the release of a luck or Perry or Lamar 
So if you're trying to get the ball out a little bit faster, this is not gonna be your guy. Now Luck has a better release than Lamar and he's gonna be fast enough to pick up some yards. When things break down, he's gonna be able to get out there and just, you know, be fast enough to pick up that first. I think you feel his speed if you got him. He's my quarterback right now I've been using lately. Just, he's just good enough, he really is. Traditional four is the best release in the game. And he's gonna hit the thresholds. He can be able to juke and make people miss, of course, and it's not what you're gonna use him for. But he does get good discounts with a great release. Andrew Luck is a great quarterback. Lamar Jackson is just Luck with more athleticism. They have the same release, and he has an X factor that Luck doesn't get. So Lamar is going to be better because of that. So with his speed, his release, and his X factor, Lamar Jackson's unbelievable in this game. He's so much fun. He's so good. And I will say, yes, his discount's fine. With Gunslinger, definitely put that on there if you want there. If you want that, uh, Trust is going to be very effective. Separate lead, of course. So, yeah, Lamar Jackson is definitely the second best quarterback in the game. William Perry is still number one, and it's really not debatable. It really isn't. He has the best release in the game. He's fast. He hits all the thresholds. He's not going to really miss throws like that. He's going to hit the short, medium, deep thresholds on the run thresholds. Duke spin all that and now why is he number one because he is the best AP stack in the game if you didn't know now you know gunslinger for zero so if you're trying to save AP you want the best release and a guy that can run this is the only option because he is the best setup in the game because he gets gunslinger for zero so yeah go get William Perry as the number one quarterback in the game which you go get this guy and you sell Vic you're not going to go back. You know why? Because his release is better. Getting the ball out, you're going to feel a night and day difference there. You're going to be like, wow, that was actually easier to throw the ball. And I got the ball to my guy when he was actually open on time. So, yeah, go get William Perry. Guys, I just did the top 10 must-have cards. Up next is top 10 pass rushers. This is video two of three today. I'll see you in those videos. Be kind to everyone. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for supporting. Thanks for joining me in this one. And thanks for hitting the like button because I didn't waste your time. Have a good day. Over at EasyMutt.com right now, guys, new technology. You can buy the points at 50% off and get an additional 10% off when you use my code. So what are you waiting on? You can still buy your coins or the points, whatever you want. Go save your money. Save NBAMT.com. You enjoy 2K24 right now. Get 10% off using code CUTE. Go get the player you want. Go build the player you want. Look at these prices. They're absolutely ridiculous.